This instrument is a spine surgeon's best friend, and if you've ever heard of a procedure called a laminectomy, it's one of the most common procedures we do. And we use this instrument, which is called a kerosene rongeur. A laminectomy is a procedure where we go in and relieve pressure on the nerves in the back or neck, and we remove the back part of the bone called the lamina. That's done so we can remove any bone spurs or disc herniations that's pressing on the nerves. And here you can see the lamina present, and how it looks after we remove it. This is a model of a spine and the lamina is the very back part of bone right here. And this is what we remove during a laminectomy procedure or a discectomy procedure. The kerosene rongeur is an instrument that we use on a daily basis in spine surgery. So let's talk about how it works. If we look at the instrument itself, it has this handle where the surgeon can grip and that back part that rests up against the surgeon's thumb. And then this is the shaft of the instrument and then the cutting portion of the instrument. So when we squeeze this handle, you can see how that shaft is deployed to cut the bone at the tip of it. If you look at the distal tip of the instrument, that's what it looks like when you close it. The tip of the kerosene is very smooth and the cutting part is between this part of the instrument. Now, what you do is you slide it between the bone and the dura, or the covering of the nerves, and when you squeeze, it will carefully cut bone off. To demonstrate, we take this instrument and slide it up underneath the lamina and then squeeze it. And when we do that, it will make several cuts across this part of the lamina and this part of the lamina, and then that will allow us to remove the bone. When we do a laminectomy procedure, we can slide this instrument up under the lamina and then squeeze the handle, and that will allow us to cut the bone here and then over on this side as well. The key to this instrument is that it is smooth on this back surface, which will, will protect the nerves while we're performing the laminectomy. Now, kerosene rongeurs come in many sizes. This is a three millimeter, which is my favorite size. This is a four millimeter and that the measurement just basically tells us how wide that footprint is. And they go anywhere from one millimeter all the way up to six or seven millimeters. But the most commonly used size is a two to three to four millimeter kerosene. So that my friends is how we perform a laminectomy with one of the most common instruments in spine surgery, the kerosene rongeur.